Hello everybody, what an honor to be receiving Athletes Can Leadership Award. I'm so sorry I can't be with you tonight. The good news is I'm in Australia. <laughs> if there's any reason, right, it's, it's to be in Australia is okay. I had a previous speaking engagement already booked, but I, it means a lot to me. I've watched Athletes Can over many, many years from the time I was sort of at the end of my career till now develop into such an amazing place for advocacy, for promoting athletes and making sure that the system really is athlete-centered. To be awarded this leadership um, a, a prize award is, is incredible. It was of course an amazing year for me as chef de mission, 20 years since I won the Olympic Games and what a journey it's been. I myself have a few times stood up and, and taken a stand to do what I hoped was right for athletes. Um, it's evolved into watching the system change a little bit and feeling like it was a time I could come back and make a difference. This team this year was absolutely remarkable. It was such an honor to lead them. Um, the best decision I made at the Games was no media, no events, follow the team. And I think that's what Athletes Can is all about. It's about being athlete-centered, having athletes back, being for them when it counts the most. And that's really what I tried to be as chef de mission. So, sorry I couldn't be there. I've lost my voice because I've given my everything once again for the athletes here at the Heroes Parade in Toronto. But have a fantastic evening, huge award, and I take it very, very, with, with much humbleness, but also much gratitude. Thank you so much.